Hi, I'm Bob Lutz, Paul Sullentrop. We're from the Wichita Eagle. We witnessed history today, I guess. Wichita State drubbed here in Cedar Falls by 16 to Northern Iowa. Yeah, a lot of streaks ended. Uh, I did not expect that. I thought it would be a, a close game, and I thought when Evan Wessel hit, his, hit that three to start, maybe that was a good omen for Wichita State. Paul and I hang out a lot on the road, and we talked about this game, and Paul did say if Evan Wessel makes two three-pointers, the Shockers will win. He made one. He made one. And it, it, I think you said if he made only one, they'd lose by 16. Correct? I did say that. Yeah, I, I think if you're Wichita State, you've got to look at it and say we were 5 of 24 from three. Uh, that's not the way we usually shoot. If we make only three or four more, then this is maybe a different game. That's what you take out of it if you're, if you're the Shockers. If you're Northern Iowa, you say we made five three-pointers but only needed to shoot seven because we got the ball inside a lot. Yeah, they definitely won the, uh, the mental game or whatever. I mean, they look like a better team than Wichita State. They look really deep. They look really athletic, and uh, they really played well. Shockers just couldn't guard two Northern Iowa players. Seth Tuttle, Wes, Wes Washburn, they got anywhere they wanted to on the floor. No answers. That's odd to see a Wichita State struggle defensively like this one did tonight. Yeah, I was trying to think when the last time was. Kemba Walker is the guy that came to my mind that they couldn't guard, and then some people on Twitter pointed out uh, uh, Julius Randle from Kentucky and, and the Harrison kids from Kentucky would have been good choices too, but we don't see that very often. Wichita State loses their 27-game Missouri Valley Conference regular season win streak, bites the dust, throw in three more in the Missouri Valley Conference tournament. They go to Bradley next. I don't think they'll have quite as much difficulty at Bradley. Could this turn out to be a good thing for Wichita State? I, I mean, I... Is I, that crazy? No, I, I, well, I don't think there's anything to worry about. I mean, this is a... We've seen what this team can do over the last two or three years. They're, they will bounce back from this fine. And, uh, it'll be a big game on February 28th. We'll see you February 7th. That's next Saturday. Wichita State welcoming back their 1965 Final Four team. I think we're all looking forward to that. That'll be a lot of fun. See you later. Thanks.